Hello everybody, this is Gold Glee Gamer 1 and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Beldum, to tell me what good are you? You still haven't taken care of that Mario character. Well, yes, sorry, but only because he's tougher than we thought at first. You do understand that we x knots must open the door first, do you not? Well, rest assured that I will definitely nail him next time. We have prepared a weapon that will bring him to a quick and certain end. I trust your words, though I rapidly lose my patience. Just leave it to us, sire. That's the way, my lovelies. Marilyn? Vivian? No doubt about it, I'm officially bored. Those awful X things haven't been back to ask about the map. I wonder, is it safe? Oh my, that must be tech again. Okay, I guess we're going through here to talk to Tech again. Hello, Princess Peach. You always call me in without warning, Tech. What is it this time? I apologize. I would like you to go to where Sir Grotus is and ask me something. Ask him something. What do you mean, go ask? <laughs> I recently obtained specific information that brought an issue to my attention. You are the main computer here, right? Why is there anything you don't know? I am unable to know things that are not entered in my CPU or otherwise recorded. That is why I want to know what Sir Grotus is thinking about the issue. But even if I try to go see him, they'll catch me and send me back to the room. That is true, but you will find a soldier's room one floor up. Take the elevator. Once there, please obtain a soldier's uniform and change into it, avoiding detection. You will go see Sir Grotus looking like a soldier. <clears throat> you mean I'll be disguised? I imagine you won't take no for an answer, will you? You imagine correctly. Alright, fine, I guess. Well, so what do you want me to do to ask this Grotus? I will tell you. The world is tech thing. I mean, honestly, he sure is a weird computer. Is that the elevator he wanted me to go in? Uh, looks like it. Please wait just a moment. There are currently soldiers in the vicinity. Now, Princess Peach, it's the room with a green lamp near, very near where you disembark the elevator. Okay. Is this it? No. Oh, this is just another elevator. What about this door? No. Okay, it has to be this one then. Okay, I guess not. I guess I'll turn around. Okay, this has to be it. Please change here quickly. The soldier's uniform should be in a locker. Okay. Well, let's open them up and see if we can find it. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, maybe this, maybe that's it? Okay, this has to be it. <clears throat> that is correct. <clears throat> okay. <clears throat> Alright, well. 
go in here and put it on. Oh, about this, it's awfully tight and it kind of smells a bit. Who knows? I got into it. I can barely breathe, though. I bet I look perfect. Hey, slacker, what part of do not leave your post do you understand, huh? What? Come again? Oh, who are you in rake? Well, fine. Carry on. <clears throat> if you have nothing to say, it's okay. Alright. Excuse me, Sir Grotus. Yes, what is it? Speak. Well, it's about Princess Peach. What do you plan to do with her going forward? Hmm. Nothing is wrong with your voice, x not. Perhaps I have a throat lozenge, no? Well, never mind. Okay, about Princess Peach. I have no interest in what that woman has to say. Just keep her locked in the room. But don't ever treat her roughly, understand? Tell the others as well. Why? Why in the world are we keeping her here, then? That's none of your business. Don't forget your place, you impudent worm. Concentrate on getting the legendary treasure. That is all I require of you. We ex need that treasure to conquer the world. Don't forget it. Conquer the world? Legendary treasure? What are you blathering about now? Something is odd about you. No, nothing odd. No, ro Roger, whatever. Please excuse me. Oh, that was unnerving. All that stuff about conquering the world? Talk about creepy. I wonder if that has anything to do with collecting those crystal stars. Ah, uh, might as well. Gold pink dress, my favorite. Why would I ever wear anything different? I better get back quickly. Heck, you terrible machine. So your goal is to conquer the world, is it? Of course, after all, I was built for that purpose. Conquering the world? How could you? That's a speech. Allow me to ask. Do you like the world you live in? There are many problems in the world. Many sorrows. Do you like such a world? No, oh, nobody likes everything about the world, but I love the good parts. There are many sorrows, sure, but there is also joy. Is that so? Tell me, will the Crystal Star help you conquer the world, and what's this treasure? I'm afraid I cannot answer. Answering those questions is prohibited by Sir Grotus. Oh, never mind. I must at least inform Mario about this awful plan for world domination. Tech, let me use their communicator. I suppose I can allow that. Please use the communicator. Send it this instant. The message has been sent. Well then, Princess Peach, you have a busy day. Go back to the room, please. Okay. Good night, Princess Peach.
Okay, well, that was the peach scene. And now let's see what Bowser's up to. That thing's humongous. Everybody, hide now. Save yourselves. Stupid cheating Mario. Who would have thought that fool would be in Glitzville? Did you say something, you rudeness? Well, as far as you know. Hey, did you see those little bite-sized shrimps? Where were the? What were those things? Those were some punies. One of them should know about the crystal star. They fear you, so they're all hiding. Let's find them all and get the info we need. Be gone. You're one of them, aren't you? You're one of the evil doers. You want our crystal star. Ah, see? I knew it. This ugly thing knows where the crystal star is. Tell us. How rude. Ugly thing. How dare you, wretched crone. I am the great puny elder. Eep. My heart. Don't startle me like that. I'm too old for this stuff. I right, say that. Yes, Lord Bowser, you look as if you're just dying to say something. Uh, nope, nothing. Let's move on, shall we? You, Elder Hag thing, where's the Crystal Star? And don't try pulling rank again. Your answer, not your age, will determine your fate. Hag thing, honestly, in any case, you're too late. The Crystal Star is gone. That's right, you rude thing. We gave it to a mustache man named Martio. He said he was collecting the legendary treasures to rescue some princess. What did he call her? A uh, Princess Pinch? Yep, yeah, he was off to save that lucky lass. It's Mario, not Martio. And it's not Princess Pinch. Her name is Princess Peach. But your sen senility is beside the point. The princess and treasures must be connected. Mario's trying to get it all. Treasures, princesses, does he? His greed never end? That jackal. Both Princess Peach and the Crystal Stars belong to me. To me! If I find him, I'm going to finish him off once and for all. I swear it. You know how many times you've said that, Bowser, and you always fail? So why would today be any different? So now you must leave. I understand. If you must, you must. We won't delay you. I hope you succeed in finding the rest of the Crystal Stars. Good luck. Gonzalez, I want to tell you, Rock Hawk ain't going to fight dirty anymore. I'm going to hit the weights, take some vitamins, and win the title fair and square. And I'm never, ever going to lose again. Remember, when life rocks you, rock back. Listen, G-Money, thanks for everything, man. You're the nicest dude I ever met, and if you ever need it, I got your back. Hey, I think I'm going to chill here and improve my skills. King K's back, baby! And it's all thanks to you, dog. You're my boy, Mario. Now that Grub is out of the picture, I'm going to take over running the Glitz Pit. If you ever decide to run to the ring, just come back. I'll keep your spot open. You have tons of fans, and they absolutely love it if you'd made a comeback. Anyway, think it over, okay? And travel safe. Well, farewell, Glitzville Arena. It was great. Alright, that makes three crystal stars. We better get back to the rogue port, Mario. Yep, I'm way ahead of you on that.
All right, well, and now we're back in Rogueport. And we might as well stop here for today. So, until next time, this is Gold League Gamer 1. Later, folks.